everyone today i have a few dolls to show you from my break away in york um in york there is a large doll shop called mary shortles i've had dolls from her before and she also does online sales um i haven't actually visited the shop in years but i have been before oh a long while ago um and my holiday treat from my husband was to go in the shop with his bank card. I tried to restrain myself. I could have bought 15 dolls and I bought three. So I'll show you the three that I bought. Um, it was very difficult to choose though. The dolls in there are just gorgeous. So I got one of these. She is a Lauren's, Lorenz, that's a Spanish brand, I believe, Miss Minnie's doll. Look how cute she is. Look at her little face. Um, I have had her out of the box. I'm going to take her out again and show you. So you can see she, her box is similar to an ice cream look. This is the cornet bit around the side. Handmade in Spain, it says. Look, this is the, label, the tag that's inside. And look at all these gorgeous little girls. Look how cute they are. That one's got a lollipop. And then there's three more on the back here. I honestly did struggle to choose one. But I chose this one because I loved her outfit. Hey, this is the one I chose. Miss Bella Pan. <laughs> Miss Bella Pan. Oh, she's gorgeous. Yes. Um... And there's a Lauren's Fun Club, but there's not actually a lot of English on there. It's in the, in other languages. So I like the way that the Spanish attach their dolls into their boxes. They have these little hooks here. And she just had a, a rubber band hooked in one side. And then it went around her neck to hold her in. And you can see she's got like a little scene in the back of their little cake shop. How cute is that? Very pretty. And here is our little doll. She is adorable. I absolutely love her. She's got, she's got her little cornet look. It's made of hessian. And then she's got a little pom-pom and a smaller one on the top. And it does look like a little ice cream. I was swayed by her dark hair and her little outfit. She's got on these like a... I would call them dungarees, but they are so cute. Look at those. And then she's got these little white slippers on with a little black tie up the top. Um, her clothing does come off. And underneath her little romper stroke dungaree, she's got like a little cotton t-shirt top that Velcro's in the back. She's just so cute. I love her so much. I just couldn't resist that cute little face. How cute is that? And then her little legs as well. Look at her little legs. <laughs> she is just adorable. I, I really did struggle to choose one out of the, out of the ones that, that were on offer. But I, I'm so thrilled with her. She's so cute. Love her. Yes, and she's called Be Miss Bella, Bella Pam. And she also has pom-pom elastics in her hair look love her so much so chuffed with her and then i also bought this doll by the same she's by the same maker so she's a a spanish doll look how cute she is though but she's a lauren's doll as well i'm saying lauren's i hope i'm saying that right lauren's lorenz um she was held in in the same way with a piece of elastic just around her neck these dolls were around 30 pounds each this one and the last one the lauren's dolls but i love this one's little face look how cute she is you can see she's around let's measure them and let you know properly so both of these dolls are around 10 inches but you can see her look with a lovely hair and it's so soft that hair is look how nice that is look at her little eyes and her lovely little mouth little um, blushed cheeks, little ears. Look at those tiny ears. How cute are they? <laughs> then she's got this like little um, waistcoat thing on that's fur lined at the front. And then she's got this little dress underneath. I will get around to making her another dress. 
this is her winter dress i wouldn't need to make her a summer one look at the detail on her little hands look can you see you see like the little wrinkles on her fingers and that and her the detail on her nails and things she has got some little under crackers on and she's got on these little grey boots that match her um, little waistcoat and then she's got her little hat yeah this is a this is a winter outfit she needs a summer one doesn't she so I shall have to make her a summer outfit but yeah so cute there we are <gasps> love her so much yeah she's a little 10 inch doll love that little face she's just gorgeous brings me joy so that was the two that was two of the three dolls that my husband treated me to and then the third one i absolutely love this doll and before i went in the shop this was the one i wanted um now mary wasn't actually in the shop when i went but her father was there and he was really helpful and um helped me choose this girl she is a marina and pow doll and she is he described her as a first reborn doll but um i just loved how she looked and how she feels in your hands and she's hand painted look at that face <laughs> how gorgeous is she just look at her She's got a little baldy head, but look, you can see, look, the little veins painted on her. Look at her little ears. She's got her little eyelashes. She's even got like little um, shiny bits under her nose and her little mouth is shiny. She's got lovely blue eyes. She is, she has got full, I think it's vinyl arms look at her little nails and her hands look at the painting look the veins painted on her hands look at this she smells gorgeous she smells like vanilla too and these shoes oh i love those shoes they're just so cute and if you they have velcro fastening and you can you take them off look at her little feet oh she's got a little nails painted she's got the painting on her little feet and there's the sole of her foot oh she's just gorgeous she really is these lovely soft little socks she's got on and then she has a weighted lovely soft body it's really soft and like um like a short fleece i'd say that is and then she's got on her little knickerbockers underneath there that match her dress they're the same colors there's a little dress she's got her little cardigan little knitted coat cardigan there so cute love that little cardigan her dress does velcro all the way in the back yeah she's doing and she's got her little nunny that velcros onto there as well and you can nip that and put it in her mouth if you want to and then of course her gorgeous little knitted hat that matches her cardigan how gorgeous is that hat i love it so she again is in her winter outfit and uh, she needs a summer outfit so i will get around to making a one but i just i fell in love with her when i saw her i couldn't resist her she's just so gorgeous look at her yeah she's just I'm so thrilled with her. She's just absolutely gorgeous. So that is my, and I named her Amelie. I just love that name, Amelie. A bit like a cross between Amelia and Emily. Amelie, yeah, lovely. I think it really suits her. She's such a gorgeous girl. And while I was away, I wanted to, um, because she doesn't didn't come in a box or anything, I wanted to, to travel home safely. So I bought her this blanket. I was going to crochet her a blanket and I worked out it was going to cost me around £12, which is fine to crochet her a blanket. But then I saw this one. I got it from TK Maxx and it was £10. And I thought, well, that's actually cheaper than me crocheting a one. So I bought her that instead. But it is so soft. 
it's really soft and it's lined with like a soft velour soft short velour so she came wrapped in that i popped her in that in a bag to bring her home so that was my lovely dollies that my husband treated me to from mary shortles <laughs> i hope you enjoyed that thank you for watching bye for now